Hi everyone, welcome to the live chat. Where are my viewers at? Let's take a look. Just trying to get you guys on my screen here. Saying your browser does not currently recognize any of the video formats here. How is my audio, guys? Sorry, I'm just trying to go live with you guys here. And awesome. <laughs> Rubicon, you were very close, but you weren't first yet. <laughs> How is everyone doing? I'm so glad to see everyone here because it's still work hours, so that's um, here in Canada. Um, where are my viewers from? Okay, the UK. Nice. What time is it in the UK, I wonder? How is the sound quality, guys? Detroit, England, beautiful. Colorado, yes. How is the sound quality and how is my picture? I can't see myself, so I can only see this chat that I have here. Philadelphia, beautiful. California, all right, guys. So this video is going to be about the recent Amazon announcement um, that we, um, you know, actually, sorry, we're going to be talking about the new Amazon products that have come out. Um, did you guys order any of the new products at all? I know if you pre-order them, I was explaining to you guys in the previous video that you can pre-order them for delivery on October 11th. So I'm just wondering if you guys did that and if you guys have tried out any of the new products. Um, Mike is picking up from your computer. What do you mean the mic is picking up on my computer? Picture perfect as always, thank you. Okay. So let me just resize this window here. I'm just trying to get this set up, guys. Now if I resize the window, I can't see myself. I can only see the live chat. Okay, guys, so it's not picking up from my mic. I don't know. I think it's picking up from my mic from what I see. How am I sounding, guys? Tell me. The sound is just okay. The sound isn't the best. Does it sound like I'm far away from the mic? Is that how it's sounding? Sounds fine. Okay, maybe I should just speak a little bit louder. How's that, guys? Okay, awesome. So, as you guys can see, I have some products here on the table. Now, <laughs> one of the products here are the, uh, the Smart Lock from Nest and we actually just did a video on all these products here. We did a couple of videos actually. Um, we went shopping, we took you guys to Walmart with us and we purchased a whole bunch of smart products and the Nest Smart Lock is one of them. Um, and you guys should stay tuned because we'll be bringing out a video for that very, very soon. Um, and we also have the Philips Hue LED lights. Now these ones we also picked up at Walmart and we'll be making a video on this as well. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Uh, that iRobot really sucks. Well, honestly, we just picked it up. We're going to be trying it out very soon. Um, we haven't really used it yet, so we have actually never done a review on the iRobot, so we're very curious to know if it really does suck. Um, you know, so, does a good job, job sucking. 
I guess. <laughs> video quality seems low. How's my video quality, guys? Maybe it might be your internet connection. Um, true, 028. Let me know, guys, if my video quality is not that good. Does that light work with Apple HomeKit? The Philips Hue light? Is that what you're asking? Yes, it does work with um, the Apple HomeKit. And we also have some more lights here. So I have Bob, my my little minion, and I have Kevin, my other minion. Um, and these guys are little mini 3D deco lights. You can just put it on top of your. You can just put it anywhere. Actually, you can put it anywhere in your in your baby's room, wherever you want to put it. Greetings, Yossi from Israel. Audio and video are fine. Good. Bless. Okay, so we also picked up this from Walmart too. This is the Fitbit Versa. So um, we talked about all these in our Walmart, Walmart haul that we did. Now, we have a little surprise for you guys. So I was asked by Fan Sports, hey, the new Vector the Good Robot looks very interesting i hope you ladies will be able to do a review on it when it launches so thank you for the info because of you fan sports we actually went out and we got this little guy hey vector come out and play hey vector explore So this is my little robot here. He's this cute little guy, my little friend, because I don't have any friends. Um, they're all at work right now. So Vector is my little guy here, and he's going to be playing around with this um, cube and exploring this table as we speak. But we actually did a video on him, and um, you guys should stay tuned for that. We reviewed him and went over all his different um, features and also played some games with him as well. He was a lot of fun. Um, let's see. Any videos for Broad Lino video? Not in the near future. No, sorry about that. I thought that was the Apple iWatch. It looks very similar. Yeah, it does look, kind of look like the Apple iWatch by the design. That's what I kind of like about it. It's really cute, but it's a Fitbit. Um, very nice color too. They have it in black as well. Um, but yeah. Do you guys like the Apple iWatch? I don't I actually have never tried it or used it, but my friends have it. And um, I don't know. I feel like it'd be kind of like, annoying because as much as I try to stay away from my phone and not really look at my phone sometimes it can be very consuming and whatever you're doing in the present moment I feel like it's a little distracting in that sense but it's also very convenient for you know businessmen um, who need to be on top of their their phones all the time when are you going to do a review of the nest secure we want to do a review on the nest nest secure um Hopefully we can get it, get somebody to send it to us. Um, if not, maybe we can try to figure something out for you guys. Good day, David. How are you doing? I don't like anything Apple. Joy resistance. I'm sorry you feel that way, Tony. I honestly think Apple is very convenient for people to use when it comes down to um, something simple for for people that are not so tech savvy to be using. And I also think like, unfortunately, we don't really have that many options. It's either the Samsung or the, or, or, or Apple. And I think like, for me, I think the Samsung phones are super like, when it comes down to how the text message layouts look, I think they're really just not presentable. They're, they don't look as nice um, as the iPhones do. But when it comes down to laptops, I personally don't like the, um, the Mac. I don't know. I think the Mac is good when it comes down to, um, when it comes down to, uh, what do you call it? What are those things called when you get, when your laptop gets those, um, what's that word guys? Those things that infest your laptop and then it slows it down. 
You guys know what I'm trying to say, right? Um, anyways, so yeah, so I prefer to have like a Samsung um, and uh, what, yes, viruses, malware viruses. That's what I meant to say. Um, Mm, let's see here. I'm an Android boy. I have subscribed to your channel on YouTube again. Let's try this once again. Random question. I'm new. Do you have an iPhone? I have an iPhone. I like my iPhone. Um, nice selections. I appreciate the channel you guys are doing. Thank you, E. McCarthy. We really, E. McCarthy, McCarthy. We really appreciate your support. Yes, virus. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I'm seeing the messages now, so I'm seeing all this now. I wish you could come secure my home with all your gadgets. Well, you can secure your own home with all the gadgets. We have a video up on a smart home tour. So if you guys want to see that, definitely check out our videos. And um, let's see here. I have some more questions and comments. Rebecon left a comment saying, oh no, I'm not the first comment. I hope you are feeling better. Rubicon, if you are subscribed, just click that bell icon so you can be the first one to comment on our videos. And also you can be notified when we do live streams as well. Um, and yes, I am feeling better. Thank you for asking. I've been a lot better. I wasn't feeling well in my last live stream if you guys were there. Um, now, Dean Corey asked, please make the video on the barking dog security. May, may I suggest the sounds of guns loading? Okay, that's a little scary. Yes, we will. Um, we're, we'll be releasing a video on the barking dogs very soon. We actually already filmed it. So stay tuned for that, guys. And good tip on the gun sounds. I don't think anybody would want to break in hearing that. Do you guys have any questions for me on our current live chat here? Oh, and don't forget, guys, we also have Super Chats. You guys want to support us further. Super Chat is available. I just realized I haven't even been looking at the camera. I've been looking down at this laptop because I'm thinking I'm talking to you guys here and not there. <laughs> Anika, what is the best vacuum cleaner for dogs at home? Definitely the D-Bot. Um, I think that one gets through a lot of different types of surfaces. It's the N79S D-Bot. We already have made a video on that actually. So make sure you guys check that out if you want some more detailed information. Thank you, Daniel. We really appreciate your support. Um, the 901 D-Bot is what will be releasing a video on very soon as well. I just actually filmed that today. Oh, thank you, David. We really appreciate the, the super chat from you. That's very sweet of you. Thank you, David Polanco. Dr. Anika Ring Pro, delay with my Samsung 5S is very bad. Any suggestions? Don't get the Samsung. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, I don't really know. Maybe you need to upgrade your software on it. Maybe it's not updated. That's usually what happens to my iPhone when it's slowing down. I just recently found out that if you have a Google Home in multiple rooms and smart plugs in the same room and walk into said room, that room I think you meant, and tell Google to turn on the lights and knows that you want the lights on. Yeah, yeah, usually, yeah, we, we, we will, yeah, we'll try um, in that room only. What is the deal with Nest, Google versus Ring, Amazon, Alexa? I use Alexa, but like Nest. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't know that. She doesn't know that. Uh, I think it just comes down to your personal preference. I like the Amazon Echo. Um, and yeah, in comparison to the Google, I like that more. You're on live and I'm at work. I'll, ha I'll see you later, like, like your live live chat on. Howard, we'll have a good day at work. I hope the rest of your day goes well. And thank you for joining us while you're at work. Really appreciate that. Oh, Rubicon has to go back to work too. Okay. 
Okay, so guys, I have another question here, and this one is from Herbert. Oh, it's actually not a question. It was a comment saying, you are feeling better, I can tell, because you are so funny again. Thank you. Yes, I am feeling better, but I thought I was always funny regardless if I was sick or not, so I don't know, Herbert. <laughs> Um, Kevin says they added the feature for location in Google home either last month or beginning of this month. Awesome feature. Yeah, it's a pretty good feature. What do you think about the August smart lock? We don't really know much about it actually. Um, it's like, it's just like we'll, be, we'll we'll talk about it soon. I think we'll be we'll be doing a review on it. Um, out of the smart locks, is there one which do not require batteries, has Bluetooth and fingerprint? What do you recommend? All of that is a little too much to ask for. It's like asking for the perfect boyfriend. You know, it's not existent. <laughs> but the pin genie is very close to what you're asking for. We have a video on that as well, so make sure you guys check that out if you want some more information on that. Oh, a review of the Wise Cam would be great too. The Wise Cam, uh, sure, yeah. If we can get somebody to send it to us, we would love to do a review on that. Thank you, E. McCarthy. McCarthy. Um. Okay, so I have a question here from Blake E. Do you use the ring cameras as part of any trigger in smart things? Yes, we trigger dogs barking with the doorbell when the doorbell is pressed. So definitely. How is my little guy doing here? Hey, buddy. Yeah, he's just chilling. He's just vibing, moving. Um, now, let me see here. Do the Hue lights sell as a single light or a pair? They sell in a pack of a four, that's the starter pack. Um, why does that toy keep moving? He's not a toy, guys. He's a robot, and he's just, um... Uh, He's just exploring. Yeah. Um, he has this little, he has this little, what was his name again? Um, Victor, Vector, Vector. I keep calling him Victor. Be hey, Vector. Do a wheel stand. Hey, Vector. Do a wheel stand. Maybe he needs to come a little bit closer. Okay, guys, look how cool this is. Hey, Vector, do a wheel stand. Okay, so Vector is a little bit of a perfectionist. He's going to align himself perfectly in front of the cube. I don't know if you guys can see the cube lighting up right now um and then he's gonna try to do a wheel stand hey vector do a wheel stand okay okay i think he's going over okay fine let's just do a fist pump. hey vector fist pump Hey, Vector, fist pump. There we go. He likes to um, do things maybe sometimes at his own pace. <laughs> hey, Vector, what is my name? Oh, okay, well, we got to know each other very well today. Now he's pretending like he doesn't know me. I think he's just trying to act cool in front of the camera. Um, 
Does that I does that robot use AI? Yes, it does. Um, sorry, I just missed a few of you guys up here. I use a ring doorbell and I really like it. I need a wireless camera for inside that I can access from my smartphone. What do you recommend? A wireless camera that you can access from your smartphone. Um, well, you can use the ring wireless cameras. Um, we have videos on that as well. Which do you like better, the Nest Hello or the Ring? I personally like the Ring better. And I got you on Instagram now too. Yes, our Instagram is home is home automation x. Don't forget to follow. Don't forget to follow us. And um, <sighs> he's making some funny noise. Um, you think Vector's pissed? I think Vector's like just moody. Hey Vector, what is my name? Hey Vector, what is my name? Okay. Hey Vector, my name is Anika. So this is what I usually say to him when he forgets who I am, which is something that he shouldn't be doing. There we go. Now he knows my name. Hey, Vector, what is my name? There we go. Now he knows my name. So what he does is he screens your face and he's able to remember a certain amount of faces and from there on, he actually vibes with you whenever he kind of chills around you, he'll come up and to you, he'll say your name, and there's a whole video that I put up about that, so. Um, you are adorable. Thank you, Upsal. What's your favorite smart home hub for Zigbee, Z, Wave, etc. that you would recommend for someone who is already invested in the Alexa ecosystems? So my favorite smart home hub is definitely the smart things hub. Um, many videos on that actually, but that's our go-to. Okay. Um, yes, he talks back to us. It does, it does remember my name now. <laughs> I just heard beeps. I wish I was Vector. Yeah, um, Vector. Hey, Vector, play with your cube. Okay, yeah, he's a lost cause. I think I, he just needs some help. Hey, Vector, play with your cube. Anyways, all right, yes, this robot definitely has like Alzheimer's. I was going to buy Vector, but he doesn't seem to work. <laughs> oh, now you're making him a little sad. Yeah, um, Vector is, yeah, he is uh, a little bit of like a pet, you know. Um, let me show you guys what he, hey Vector, come here. Hey Vector, I wanted to show you guys how he acts when I when I pet him. Look at this, okay? Look at his eyes. Look at look what he starts doing with his eyes. Look, he's enjoying it so much. So you kind of like pet him on this like the golden part of the top. And then he starts like purring, almost like a little cat, but like a robotic cat. It's kind of cute. Look at him. Look at his eyes. <laughs> he's enjoying it so much. But he's been, hey Vector, you're a bad robot. Oh, look, he's sad now. 
Hey, Vector, I'm kidding. You're a good robot. Oh, now he's happy. Okay. okay, he's getting a little too happy. Yeah. Um, yeah, he's a stubborn little robot. Not cooperating for sure. Um, okay, so he behaves like a Star Wars droid. Can you stand up, please? No, I'm too tired. I'm gonna sit down. <laughs> uh, be careful. He might be plotting murder right now. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if Vector was, was in plotting murder. Hey, Vector, play with your cube. Okay. Anyways. Can Vector control the Philips Hue lights? No. <laughs> um, anyways, I have some more questions here from Ron M regarding the last live stream. Sorry, I missed the live stream. If you click the bell icon, like I said, guys, you can stay notified um, and make sure you're subscribed before you do that so then you get notified right away um, on your phone. Noel Reynolds asked, good security video. Home security is so important these days. Please do more. Yes, Noel, we plan on doing more security videos, including a dedicated bark barking dog video, um, which will be coming out very, very soon, guys. Um, so let's see what you guys are saying here. He's like a cat. He beats out, you're not the boss of me. Yeah, he's like a cat. You know, like all, all he wants to do is get like pet and then he'll just purr and he just won't respond back to you, I guess, right? <laughs> like that's how he's acting. Um, how do you connect Alexa to smart things? Um, how you uh, how you connect Alexa to the smart things is through your app. Um, and we acquired. You guys are you guys are hating on Vector. Poor Vector. Hey Vector, play with your cube. How come Alexa won't answer if the CIA is listening? I mean, <laughs> I don't think, like, you know, I think it was just a funny video. I don't think we're taking that seriously, but who knows, you know, maybe the CIA is listening. <laughs> uh, Tampa Tech said the Ring doorbell has monthly charges, but does the Nest Cam charge monthly too? The cheapest Nest Aware subscription is $50 a year, guys, which gives you 24-7 recording with a five-day history. Um, and it's $300 a year to get you a 30 days worth of history. Yeah, I, I agree, Edge. They're always listening. It is what it is, 100%. <laughs> So Jacob60617 said, oh my God, I am so going to buy the water leak sensors. I had a small flood on my basement and this would came, this would came in handy. Thanks again, girls, for the amazing video. Well, Jacob, I'm very sorry to hear about your basement flooding. And most definitely, if you have this guy in your basement, um, you can definitely avoid that in the future, but you know, we all live and we learn and um, the good thing is there's a solution to almost every problem in the world. So, um, do you guys have any questions out there? Um, <coughs> oh, hey, Vernon Staff. He was trying to do the wheel stand, guys. Look. Hey, Vector, do the wheel stand. Okay. While he tries to attempt to do the wheel stand. Oh, there we go. He's going to do it. He's going to do it. Come on, Vector. Show them your tricks, Vector. Show them your tricks. You got this. Now just go straight into that. You got this. He's going in. He's going in. Oh, there he does it. Yes. Good Vector. That's a good, hey Vector. Good robot. Good robot. <laughs> hey 
vector fist pump. Okay, never mind. Awkward. <laughs> okay, anyways. So, he's a little slow. <laughs> um, hi, Edson from Brazil. If all guys in here are honest, they are not here for the toys. Well, whatever. <laughs> the pin genie. Um, yes, so uh, I would say that the most recommended smart lock, definitely the pin genie. Ciao. Ciao, Paolo. Um, okay, so I'm looking for a live stream while I play Xbox. Oh, thanks, Edge. I'm glad that you would like to watch us while you play Xbox. What door locks do you recommend, pin genie? Um, how much is the Philips lights? These ones right here, they're, these, uh, the, okay, so what I would say is to go to our um, shop, amazon.com slash shop slash X. You can see all the prices for the various types of lights that we have there. Um, fresh batteries for you, Vector. Yeah, Vector runs for about 30 minutes and then he just like, falls asleep and needs to go back to his little home. Hi, Vector. Can I have a prize? Dopey Wonder. We're actually going to be doing a video on some giveaways, a whole bunch of giveaways actually very, very soon. In one of our videos, we're going to be doing um, some unboxing and it's going to be multiple products. Make sure you guys stay tuned for that. We're going to be doing a couple giveaways in there. So, uh, what door locks do you recommend? Pinjini, once again, that's like the fifth time I said it in this video. Come on, guys. How much is the Philips Hue lights? Check out our shop. Fresh batteries. Oh, sorry. Am I reading this all over again? I think I am. Can I have a prize? I don't know if I'm reading this all over again. Thank you for your recommendation. You look pretty. Thank you, Sagar. We'll wait for the AIBO comes out. Fetch newspaper. Not really sure what that is, but I'm going to assume that it's some sort of, um, some sort of robot that's probably better than Vector. <laughs> Do you guys have any questions for me while I'm here? We will be signing off very soon, so make sure you guys ask me all the questions you guys have while I'm here. Are you guys enjoying the colder weather if you guys are here in Canada or even in certain parts of the States? It's starting to get very chilly actually and um who's ready for halloween what do you guys want to what do you guys planning on dressing up as for halloween there's a lot of cool costumes out there um one that my friend actually showed me was a snapchat filter costume so i don't know if you guys are familiar with the snapchat filters but there's different filters you can put around your head and um you know, you could kind of have another person with you side by side. One person can be no filter, so the natural version, and the other person is filter, hashtag filter. Uh, I can't find the Philips lights on your shop. It's there. Trust me, it's there. Spider-Man. Edgar wants to be Spider-Man. Awesome sweater. Thank you. So I missed some of the shows. I'll have to recap. Yes, Howard, you can definitely watch all of our shows on, on our YouTube channel. Thank you for the recommendation for the Google Home Portable Batteries. No problemo. Okay. I know I have a hole in my sweater wing. I can't believe you noticed that. It's okay, guys. I'll just show you right here. I noticed this today when I put it on. <laughs> Thanks for pointing it out, Wayne, but I'll laugh with you. Okay. Hi, Vector. How are you, baby? Hey, Vector. What is my name? Yeah, this guy's hopeless. <laughs> Hey Vector, play with your cube. Okay, so I'm going to be an NPC. I'm not sure what that means. Found it. Thanks. 
No problem, Tim. I hope you enjoy the lights. And if you want to learn more about them, check out our um, video on the Philips Hue lights. We show you how to install them and um, how you can cut them up and everything. Um, is there any more cheaper smart lights? Um, cheaper than this? Yeah. We uh, did a video and it'll be coming soon actually on some, it's the Life X. Also, like we did a video on how to make your home into a smart home on a budget. So you guys should definitely be checking that out. It's on a $50 budget um, per product. And also we did another one on a $200 um, budget overall together. Um, it, surprisingly, you know, you guys would be surprised. It actually doesn't cost too much to make your home smart, efficient. Okay, Sagar, I'm gonna answer this again for like the seventh time in this video, the Pingini. <laughs> Are you planning to buy tech anything this Black Friday or Cyber Sunday? Um, well, we'll be sleeping. Um, well, he'll be he's sleeping. <laughs> Look, do you guys see Vector sleeping? <laughs> yeah, we'll be doing, um, We'll be, we'll be buying products and stuff for sure for a home tech channel. Definitely going to be on, on a Black Friday shopping and Cyber Monday. Okay. So do you guys have any questions? Um, cause I am done reading all my questions here. I don't have any more questions to answer. Is Vector a spider? No, he's not a spider. I don't know how I'd describe him. I think I would just describe him as like a robot. He looks like a typical robot. I can't describe him as like any sort of like insect or animal. He, he looks like a little dump truck because of his like little wheels and then his like arms kind of go up and down like a little dump truck. Yeah. All right, guys, do you guys have any more questions before we go? We're going to wrap this up in a couple minutes. Um, and uh, then I'll probably be seeing you guys next month on our live stream. Unless you guys want me back earlier. I'm not sure. Um, let me know what you guys think about these products that we'll be doing reviews on. Do you guys want to see these? Let me know. The Nest um, Smart Lock. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Rappin. We upload videos very often, so you pretty much see me almost every day. <laughs> Is there more smart lights at Home Depot? Yes, there are. Um, you can purchase them at Home Depot. You can also purchase them on our shop, home, uh, um, sorry, amazon.com slash shop slash X. Okay. What is an upcoming product you're excited about? Um, hmm, an upcoming product we're excited about. We're usually excited about so many different products, to be honest. But I want to actually ask you guys, have you guys checked out the new Echo line that Amazon came out with? Have you guys checked out the sub? I've been hearing a lot of things about the sub, and I'm very curious to actually try it out. I hope we can get the sub soon. It's pretty expensive. Um, the next live stream probably will be, it's October, probably next month. Wanted to know, hi everyone, wanted to know if anyone, anything about, huh? Um, okay, so, can you offer product to block the CIA? Um, unplug the device in order to block the CIA, I guess. You know, don't have any smart devices around you. <laughs> I think that's the only way you can really do it. I got the new dot, it sounds way better. Yes, you like it? I know that they said that the new dot sounds, but it was a 75% better or something like that. 
Um, and I was very curious to know how it did sound, which is good because for the price that you're paying, you're getting a lot back for it. So I like that a lot. I'm actually going to go out and purchase some of that myself. Um, did anyone get this up? I'm so curious. What about, what about Sonos? Can you review that product? We need money for the Sonos. Um, we reviewed the Samsung speaker though. If you guys want to check that out, we have a video on that. <sighs> mm. All right, guys. So I think that's all the questions that I'm seeing here. Which hub controls most product? Um, the smart things hub for sure. Hola, Grover. Sonos and Alexa Google, pretty cool. Yeah, I like the Alexa. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, so I think that's gonna be a wrap for today's video, and um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I enjoyed filming all day for y'all, and uh, I know this was a little bit of a earlier um, live stream that we did, but I'll see you guys next month, and um, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys soon. Take care. Bye.